but what I've also got on screen is um, planning committee 5th of September 2022 which is from Exeter City Council and that's had 54 views so far and I'm hoping it gets a, gets a lot more um, the, the potential of social media including uh, YouTube because I don't think people well perhaps not everybody realises um, YouTube's potential for commenting for discussion uh, you can make uh, playlists um, based on whatever you find from wherever uh, some I don't know quite how this works but you can make clips you can make short selections from things and put those into a tweet or social media whatever you work with so there's a lot there's a lot can be done in terms of discussion and feedback so I think it's pretty good that Exeter City Council have, have put the planning committee on online but they could go further with it um, it's 2 hours 20 22 minutes which is a very long time without any guide guides within it as to what what happens where about about an hour in you get the case against the um, proposed student accommodation block opposite St Luke's where the court and police station used to be um, and the, the the actual discussion is quite a lot further on than that it was turned down by the way which doesn't seem to have got a lot of news or comments so far but I I think that's very interesting and the reasons for that are interesting and um, so far the I can't find any response from the university well, I can't, couldn't find any comments from the university really about about the situation at all even though it's opposite St Luke's you'd think there were some people who visit St Luke's or know about St Luke's who would have a view on it but it's, it's very hard to find anything uh, so I am going to go go on and on about this um, because it's very interesting 